We are heading to Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada for the first time ever. Hi everybody, it's Tony Schiavone back in the AEW Control Center. Tonight, we broadcast AEW Dynamite live from the Canada Life Center in Winnipeg. The home, as you know, of many of our top stars. Tonight begins at 8, 7 central on TBS. If you're coming to the event tonight live in Winnipeg, tickets are available at AEWTIX.com at Ticketmaster.ca. And bell time for you in the arena is 6 p.m. tonight. Tonight's feature event will be a three-way match for the AEW World Trios title as the House of Black will defend against both the Elite and the Jericho Appreciation Society. Everybody knows that it was the Elite that established the World Trios Championships. It's very obvious that they are the number one contenders, not you guys. You are one of the greatest professional wrestlers of all time. Unfortunately, Chris, you're only the second best wrestler from Winnipeg. Oh, come on, come on, right here, right now. So this is what it feels like to be popular, having people fighting over you, huh? And all it took for the world to notice were these. The House of Black throwing down the challenge for next Wednesday night in Winnipeg. The biggest match in Winnipeg pro wrestling history. The Jericho Appreciation Society versus the Elite versus the House of Black. Also, Jericho and Omega face to face for the first time in three years. Winnipeg's own, two Winnipeg natives beating the crap out of each other in a city that knows how to fight. It doesn't matter. Jericho, if you're involved, or if it's your whole team, or that we're fighting the elite once more because it will not change the outcome. Because the fact is that this, this shall remain. Golden Boy's on top of the Parliament building. It's a famous statue. You know why I'm gonna take you there? Because I'm gonna throw a chain up there. I'm gonna pull that damn little bastard down. I'm gonna put up a gold statue of Danny, the Golden Sammy, Woo! the Golden Jericho. Yeah. The three of us perched on top of the Parliament buildings, downtown Winnipeg, the new Golden Boys, and also the new AEW Trios champions. There is a sickness in this company. There is a cancer, a tumor, and we are here to cut it out. Starting by wiping off the dirt the blood, the sweat of people that do not deserve to hold these titles. All glory to the house. Because we are the house. And the house always wins. The fact that Winnipeg's Kenny Omega will be in effect facing Winnipeg's Chris Jericho makes this match intriguing and exciting. The two men met, if you'll recall, Wrestle Kingdom 12 in Tokyo in 2018. The match that, according to Chris Jericho, was the genesis of AEW. With the Young Bucks, members of the JAS, and the House of Black all involved in this three-way, it should be one to remember for a long, long time. Also, after what went down last Wednesday, AEW All-Atlantic Champion Orange Cassidy has demanded an open challenge match against Double J Jeff Jarrett. Tonight will mark the fifth and final defense of the All-Atlantic Championship on the international soil. Tonight, in partnership with Warner Brothers Discovery to support Friday's release of the motion picture Shazam 2, Fury of the Gods, we will level up the title to the international championship. And tonight, Orange Cassidy will defend that new AEW International Championship leveled up against Double J. Oh, man. This match for the AEW All-Atlantic Championship, the rubber match between Jay Lethal and freshly squeezed Orange Cassidy. I'm in a bad mood. Bubba, you hurt your shoulder. Orange Cassidy, this trilogy, it's over. Back to the knee again, and that smart strategy that Jay Lethal has. I, I'm fed up with it, because next week in Winnipeg, this Wednesday on Dynamite Jeff, we heard the news, right? All-Atlantic title is leveling up to the international title. Jeff, tell Orange Cassidy what's going to happen to him in Winnipeg, in that godforsaken country of Canada. God, I hate Canadians. Oh! They hate him here in Sacramento, and who can blame him? 
Yeah, I guess I'm just sick and tired of this. Right across that knee, just shattered that guitar. I guess I've had enough. How many times, week after week, even day after day, are me and my best friends getting attacked? First time I've ever seen Jeff Jarrett use that guitar on a knee, and a heavily damaged knee, it was. You know, Sanjay, throughout my entire career, folks have come up to me and said, hey, Double J, hey, Chosen One, hey, King of the Mountain. And now they come up and say, hey, Last Outlaw, how are you so damn lucky? Well, it has nothing to do with luck. The definition of luck is when preparation meets opportunity. That's why I'm a 12-time former World Heavyweight Champion, a two-time Hall of Famer. I've done more first than anybody on the entire AEW roster, and I am going to be the first ever international champion. You want a shot at this? Well, then you're gonna get it. But now, I'm the one that's gonna be hurting you. And I'm gonna make history Wednesday night in Winnipeg. OC, you just got a little bit of a taste of what the last outlaws got. And I can assure you, this group right here is coming for the gold this Wednesday. And we're walking back across that border, champions. Hey, Jeff. Hey. You know, you can't spell international without Sutton and Sanjay. <laughs> Take care of that leg, Orange. Rest it up. Might want some ice. I'm so angry on you, man. Ah, <laughs> yeah, Season yeah. Last week. Yeah. In Canada. Yeah. <laughs> it's the first match for the new AEW International Championship, leveled up by AEW. Well, Powerhouse Hobbs is the new TNT champion. And tonight on the very first episode of QTV, we apparently will find out what happened to Wardlow's vehicle this past Tuesday night in San Francisco. QT says he's got the scoop. Hey, 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 what's that all about, QT? Quality television, that's what it's about, and it starts with Powerhouse Will Hobbs as your TNT champion. Um, I told you, I told you, my word is my bond. Now, no now, it took a little longer, no doubt. but man, man, is it sweeter than ever. Tell him, Hobbs. Look at this. I said last week, there's a new chapter in the book of Hobbs. It is says TNT. I'm absolutely dynamite. I'm quick, I'm swift. I got my man who keeps his word, who keeps his bond. Now, what are you gonna do? Nothing. Celebrate. Let's go. Who can we add? Who wants to be the next chapter? Not so sure what QTV is, but we have a lot of questions that hopefully will be answered tonight. One thing we know for sure QT helped Hobbs win the TNT title a week ago. And as he says, I guess, he's a man of his word. Also tonight, AEW World Champion MJF will have in the ring his rebar mitzvah. Now listen, I've checked it out. You can have a bar mitzvah once again at age 83. So I have no idea what this idiot is doing, but we will find out tonight in Winnipeg. Also tonight, in trios action, Hangman Adam Page teams with his friends in the Dark Order to meet the Blackpool Combat Club, Claudio Castagnoli, Wheeler Yuta, and John Moxley. Jake Cargill holds her Canadian Open Challenge for the TBS Championship tonight. And we will hear from the outcast, Ruby Soho, Tony Storm, and Soraya. Maybe they will let us in on who they plan to spray paint next. This and more tonight, live from Winnipeg and on TBS. AEW Dynamite, 8, 7 Central. For our Winnipeg fans, tickets available once again at AEWTIX.com and Ticketmaster.ca. Hey, guys, this Saturday, March 18th, begins our AEW House Rules Tour. We will begin this Saturday at the Hobart Arena in Troy, Ohio, with some of the biggest names in AEW in action. Bell time this Saturday, 7 p.m. at tickets at AEWTIX.com and HobartArena.com. And in one week, that's next Saturday, March 22nd, AEW Dynamite and Rampage return to the Kansas City area at the Cable Dahmer Arena in Independence, Missouri. Bell time for our fans next Wednesday in the Kansas City area, 6 p.m. local, tickets for you, at AEWTIX.com. 
And now, fans, these very important announcements. AEW returns to Las Vegas with our annual Double or Nothing pay-per-view week. The road to Double or Nothing stops with AEW Dynamite Live at the MGM Grand Garden Arena. It's on Wednesday, May 24th. Four days later, it's Double or Nothing Live from the T-Mobile Arena. And the pay-per-view is on Sunday, May 28th. And then the following Wednesday, May 31st, AEW makes its San Diego, California debut at the Viejas Arena at San Diego State University. But tonight, our long-awaited debut in Winnipeg at the Canada Life Center. We take the air at 8, 7 Central, live on TBS with AEW Dynamite. For our fans in the Winnipeg area, come early. Bell time, 6 p.m. local. Stay late for AEW Rampage. Tickets at AEWTIX.com and Ticketmaster.ca. This is Tony Schiavone in the Control Center. See you tonight ringside in Winnipeg and on TBS. We are AEW.